Hey, Trev Kreitzer at GoHunt.com. Uh, I'm here in my basement, my little bow shop. Uh, we're all in quarantine, working from home, but we thought it'd be an excellent time to do some more gear reviews for you. Today I have a couple of sidebars, uh, which we recently just started selling here in the gear shop. These are the Bee Stinger Micro Hex sidebars. They can actually be used as a front bar or a sidebar. Um, you might be asking, you know, what's a sidebar or a back bar? Um, I've got my bow set up right here that you can see. Um, so essentially what a back bar or a V-bar is, is a back, uh, stabilizer which you can add weight to to offset the weight of your sight and your rest and your quiver on the other side of your bow. What that helps you do is it, it leads to a really nice balanced bow. Uh, as you come to full draw this bow is really really stable. It's going to sit really nice in your hand uh, and it's also going to lead to uh, a better hold and you know possibly better accuracy. I certainly shoot this bow a whole lot better with a sidebar than I do uh, just a regular front bar. Like I said, this is the micro hex version. So this is a smaller diameter. Uh, these are carbon fiber uh, rods, extremely narrow as you can see. So they're gonna buck the wind pretty good. You're not gonna get near as much uh, drift as you might with a larger uh, diameter stabilizer. This comes in two different lengths. They have a 15 inch and a 12 inch. A 15 inch, which is what I've run on the front of my bow, uh, I've got three ounces of weight on the front. You know, you might be asking yourself, is that overkill 15 inches on the front bar? For Western big game hunting, if I'm hunting like open country mule deer or spot and stock antelope hunting, uh, I'm not too worried about the amount of vegetation. I'm not uh, in a bunch of, you know, brush. So the length of that stabilizer isn't necessarily a limiting factor. So I really like the way that 15 inch front bar holds. Uh, and for me, that's kind of where I've rested. Um, I'll probably end up hunting, you know, spot and stock antelope deer and, and also elk with that 15 inch front bar. We carry this in a 15 incher and like I said, a 12 incher. Uh, the 15 incher you can use either as a back bar or a front bar. You can see I've got a quick disconnect on mine there. And like I said, three ounces of weight. Um, the weight on these, you're gonna be 3.8 ounces for the 15 incher, the full length 15 inch. And you're gonna be 3.4 ounces for the total weight on the 12 inch bar. You can use this 12 incher uh, either as a front bar or a back bar. Um, these micro hexes also have a, a cool technology called countervail technology, which is an internal dampening system, which is going to reduce vibration in these bars by 40%. So this is a great little bar. Like I said, carbon fiber, you've got aluminum end caps, um, comes with the uh, end pieces here to add weight to it. We sell weights in the gear shop. so. The individual bee stinger one ounce weights we sell so you can get a custom fit for your bow. We also sell the max weights in two and four ounce uh, versions. Anyways, these are great little back bars or front bars stabilizers for your bow. Uh, check those out. If you have any questions about these, feel free to drop us a comment below. Be happy to answer that. Uh, also, we'd love it if you'd like and subscribe to our channel. Uh, these are available in the gear shop right now. Uh, once again, these are the Bee Stinger Micro Hex V-Bars.